Tina. Mm. This is a good thing here. I'm telling you, it's like a good thing with your husband. If you know what I mean. Mm. The first time I taste cappuccino, I was, I had went to this restaurant in, in the village. It was called a village. I, call, I think it's called Greenwich Village now, but then it was village. 14th Street, get about 14th Street. Uh, around, I think it's West 11th, because it's the C train or the A train. No, get off at, yeah, West Street, so it's the C or the A. I don't even know where that restaurant is there, but you would go, damn, I forgot the name of it. But it, you would go down, like walk down the steps, so it was like down in the cellar, like. And I would go there, I would even take the kids there, I'm telling you. My kids knew about fancy stuff, like. Not only McDonald's and White Castles and Burger King and stuff like that. They knew about those nice, you know, high city restaurants, you know? And we would go to that. And um, uh, after it, I, I saw they said, you want some type of dessert or something? So I was like, well, what's good after? I said, what would you get after it? I asked the waiter. And he said, he or she said, I would get me a cappuccino. After a good meal, drink a cup of cappuccino. I said, really say yes. I said, well, what is it? She says, it's a coffee, but it's a more mellow coffee. And I tasted it, and I was hooked ever since. And I, didn't, I really wouldn't eat it, I mean, drink it nowhere else except for there. Until... I tried at Dunkin' Donuts. And it's always the one at Fulton Street on the four line. Transfer from the four to the A or the A to the four. There's a Dunkin' Donuts in there, inside the station. Yup. All right, so I'm gonna I'm I'm go, cause I wanna go and get me some. Let me see how many more minutes we got. We got seven more minutes and we're gonna walk down.